What's going on guys? Today I have the review of the Mac application and this is called Sparrow. I believe it's number one in the Mac App Store. You can check it out. It is a bit pricey but for $10 you're getting a really good email um, program for the Mac. Let's go ahead and launch up into this. Once you launch it up you notice straight away you get a Tweety interface look. Go ahead and compare it right now. So this is the Tweety application, make it bigger so it looks like that, and they're almost identical, like the scrolling feature, um, almost the same, the sidebar, you get your side um, tools, and right, same here. So that's just comparison, if you like the Tweety interface, Sparrow is pretty much offering you the same thing, except it looks a bit more neater. So let's get into this, on the sidebar here, you can view your inbox, which is that logo, the star for favorites. The plain paper plane is basically for um, sent mail, drafts, trash, and you can even search through the server for um, mail from to subject or even all. Back to the inbox. Right in the top right, you notice these four little um, images or icons. If you click this, this is obviously to compose a new message. Um, you can attach a file on the top left here and attach anything you want and it'll show in the bottom right there. You can save it as a draft or send it right as you wish. Discard that for now. And when you reply to someone, um, just say Skype or YouTube, you just highlight their name or just click on their email, hit reply and it comes up um, with the reply to say it, send it to them. All right, next you click this, this is your archive. Um, click it, you can show it. I don't know if you it's valuable, doesn't really matter, but um, Trash, you can also trash mail, so here, just going to trash that, and it'll go away into your trash can, which is right here. And that is about it, guys. Uh, let's do through some preferences here. Um, basic preferences, mm, add more accounts at Gmail, so I can add my second Gmail account if I wish, and you can even add a signature. So that's about it, guys. Um... Only Gmail for now, but um, in the later versions, they said they're going to um, make the IMAP emails available, which is Hotmail, Yahoo, and AOL. So, too bad it only supports Gmail, but I'm pretty sure most people ha out there have Gmail accounts anyways. So, that's about it for the review, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Comment, like, and subscribe.